Hi, I'm Jen from Absolute Resource Associates. Water from private wells isn't regulated like town water is, so it's really important that well users test their own water for harmful contaminants like arsenic and bacteria. I'm going to show you how easy it is to get your water tested. First, you need to decide what you want to test for. If you're not sure, you can visit our website or contact your state's environmental department to find out what's recommended where you live. Next, get a water testing kit from a certified lab near you. ARA's lab is in Portsmouth, New Hampshire, but there are environmental labs all over the U.S. Just make sure the one you choose is accredited by your state's lab certification program. Your test kit will have everything you need, including instructions, which might vary slightly from what I show you here, so be sure you read through everything carefully. Before you begin, you should know that you need to drop your samples off within six hours of collection, so you should plan ahead for that. Okay, let's get started. We recommend that you take your sample directly from your kitchen sink, or whichever sink you use most often, first thing in the morning. Put on the gloves, and then unscrew the strainer or aerator that's on the faucet. Then, turn on the cold water to a gentle flow and let it run for several minutes. It usually takes five to 10 minutes to flush out the water that has been sitting in your pipes to bring up the water that we want to test. Once you are ready to fill up your bottles, line them up and follow the instructions for which bottle to fill first and the individual fill levels required. For example, at ARA, we ask that you fill the bottle for metals first and it should be filled to the bottle shoulder. However, the bottle for bacteria has a fill line so you just want to make sure that you sample the way your lab has asked so you get the most accurate results. Also, be sure not to overfill and don't touch the inside of any bottle or cap. If you see powder or liquid inside the bottles, don't rinse it out. It's a preservative. After the bottles are all filled and you're sure the caps are tightly sealed, put them into a Ziploc bag filled with ice. Then fill out your paperwork, recording the date and time you took your samples and bring everything to your lab that same day. At ARA, we ask that you drop your samples off by 4 o'clock Monday through Thursday. We don't accept samples on Fridays or the day before a holiday. Once you have your results back, usually within 10 days, you can visit this NHDES Be Well Informed page, which is a great resource for helping you understand your water report. And that's it. If you have any questions, just stop by or give us a call. Thanks for watching and good luck.